the greatest job in the world as a travel show host? Cheers. But I'm looking to glam up the stakes this weekend. Hollywood, baby. And see if I have what it takes to make it as a starlet in Los Angeles. Kick the crap out of me. Cool. The next two days, I'm sharpening my acting skills. I just want to scare all those men over there and learning some new moves. More swan, less chicken, Sam. Let's see if I've got the heat and muscle to be the next great movie star. Come on, who's next? So pack your bags, Angelina. Run for cover, Gwyneth. I'm ready for my close-up. Expect the unexpected. This weekend could only happen in L.A. I'm Samantha Brown, and my job has me traveling all over the world. But sometimes, I really need a break. So come on, pack your bags. I'm taking you away for the weekend. <laughs> this afternoon, I'm getting the lay of the land from above before I go below to see what it takes to make it in Hollywood. Are we allowed to do this? Do what? It's like we're threading a needle in between massive... Nah, it just looks space. like we are. We're, we're like 5,000 feet above these buildings. And how long have you been a helicopter pilot? Uh, a couple weeks. <laughs> Robin Petgrave, founder of Celebrity Helicopters, is giving me something more spectacular than an IMAX movie. My very own helicopter tour of Los Angeles. Here, flipper, flipper, flipper. There they are. Oh, yeah, beautiful. This is how the stars see dolphins. I think I could get used to this. You look a little hungry. I'm always hungry. Uh, let's see if we can find any place to get a little snack. Wait, it's just like a, a helicopter drive through Well, this is how we uh, do it in L.A. Where are we going? Oh, it's a surprise. You know how we do. Nice. That's right. I don't like to get out of my own helicopter. This is Da Vinci. This restaurant is just off the chain. Thank you so much. Robin knows how to treat you like a star. And I already feel like my stock in Los Angeles has shot skyward. Wow. That is fabulous. Brad Pitt never had it this good. Italian appetizers and bubbly sure taste better at higher altitudes. Now I'm doing L.A. right. In Los Angeles, where there are big homes, there are big names. That's Tom Cruise's new house. Ooh. To be a player, you have to live like one. I'm just wondering how many of those people below me are actually drinking champagne right now. Exactly. This is what the home of a multi-million dollar director looks like. I give you Steven Spielberg's house. You would never see these from the road. No, uh -uh. Now, here's a Playboy Mansion on your right. Ah, Pep's place. The Playboy Mansion. I like there's naked chicks outside. <laughs> see them in the back? <laughs> yeah, baby, yeah. Looking at the famous... Cool. I know you're all wondering if I've done some laps down there, and I'm happy to disappoint you and say no. Now we're going back into Bel Air from Beverly Hills. Palisades and Bel Air, Beverly Hills are all big budget. This is Beverly Park. But Beverly Park is the summer blockbuster. That's not a really big one. Maybe not the Hearst Castle in San Simeon. Come on. Now this is Denzel Washington's house here. Oh, the trick-or-treating must be incredible. Mom, I got a Rolls. <laughs> <laughs> How could you not love a home you can invite 5,000 of your closest friends to sleep over? Now, down here is Hollywood Boulevard. Ah, uh, the boulevard. Can you see my star in the Walk of Fame? Okay, the air pressure may be making me delusional. Uh, do you think you could drop me off at my hotel? It's just down there. You know you're getting used to this real quickly. <laughs> This cool? Just in case you're wondering what it looks like up close. Oh, look at that. Woo, cheers. Hollywood, baby. A fitting climax, at least for my first three hours in Los Angeles. This helicopter ride plus my flight from New York has tired me out, so I'm turning in. Besides, I've got to get up early. I'm here to make my mark in this town, after all. But hold on. This movie's not over just yet. Just after sunrise, Monday morning, Robin Petgrave shows me the only way true talent gets back to the airport. So, did I actually make it as a star? Well, in my head I did. <laughs>